Hi, this is Jack at Jack's Transmissions. We're going to talk about uh, clutch piston seals today and uh, OEM seal. This is what it looks like. It has a rubber lip on the end of it and uh, something like this can you know, hold up to 16, 17, 18 bar depending on the tuner and what's going on. And it's just not a very good design. The rubber will eventually begin to crack and it will rip and blow out like this one right here. It probably started at the lip and the pressure just blew the seal, rubber seal right out of the side. So piston seal failures are very common in the GR6. Uh, so there are many solutions out there for them. Some people use O-rings, some people actually use uh, steel piston rings. Uh, there are other seals out there like this Viton seal. Unfortunately, this one has a lip as well. So even though the material might be better in time, this could actually crack and blow out as well. Uh, we've seen that happen to quite a few Viton seals. Um, the seal that we design um, is pretty ingenious in that it uses a, a steel sleeve, which actually presses over the factory piston housing assembly. So that way you don't have to buy the whole billet piston assembly, um, which saves a lot of money. Uh, in the past, you know, it used to cost $1,200 to $1,500 for just one piston because the whole thing would be billet to fit the aftermarket seal. Well, this technology here uses a sleeve and we press on to the factory piston assembly, tack welded in place, and the seal that we use is the industry standard for transmission oil seals. Uh, this is a carbon impregnated PTFE seal, um, which you'd find in uh, you know, many standard automatic transmissions out there. Um, so it's a very reliable seal, it's designed for a lot of pressure, and is designed to last the life of the, the transmission at you know 20 bar plus without a problem. Uh, we also make one for the B seal as well, um, just a sleeve. Press in there, tack welded in there just to be safe. It doesn't need to be tack welded in, but we do it to be safe. And that's about it. Uh, these seals uh, really change the game as far as affordability is concerned with these transmissions. And we try to include these from every build from the FBO trans we have all the way up to the 1700.